How did it go? The mark has taken a walk in the park, so to speak. Yeah, that's great. Your second assignment is a special one, usually reserved for the most elite assassins. What's the tango this time? First of all, we don't talk like that here. We refer to our victims as targets. There aren't any tangos, marks, charlies, or code names. So nobody's going to call me Firetruck Alpha like I requested? No, that will never happen. In fact, as a result of you requesting that code name, anyone caught calling you anything other than Reynaldo or Ray will be executed immediately. That's no fun. Anyway, this assignment is a big one. The Ninja's Guild- There's a Ninja's Guild? Yes, and if you join them because you think they're cooler, then we'll assassinate the crap out of you. It's happened many times before. Now, the Ninja's Guild is trying to take all of our clientele. We need you to go in and shut down their guild. The entire thing? Yes, the entire thing. Since assassins work alone, this will probably be a suicide mission. But that's life, what can you do? See you later. But- Get going. Okay. Wait a minute, wait a minute. You're telling me there's a ninja's guild? Don't even think about it. They told me what would happen. They have warned us both. Fine, but we're supposed to take out the entire f***ing thing? That's the assignment. Oh, and don't get caught calling me Irfe Uktre Alfalfale, or you'll be executed. Somehow I don't think that will be a problem. We're gonna need some help if we want to complete this mission without dying our asses off, though. But who should we ask? I don't think we know anybody who can help. Well, let's see. What is the ninja's natural sworn enemy? Iron Chef? What? No. Iron Chef is a ninja. And not only that, but Iron Chef is a ninja that cooks. That makes him like four times deadlier than a regular ninja. Why? Think about it. He can kill you and serve you your last meal with the same stroke of any one of his Jinzu knives. Those things stay sharp forever. Okay, I give up. Not to sound completely cliche, but it has been well documented that pirates are the ninja's natural sworn enemy. Something about an ancient curse of the sea or whatever. Pirates? Hmm. I guess we should head to the nearest port. That would be Port Town Citiesville. We need to get to Port Town Citiesville fast! What's the rush? And why are you wearing assassin's armor? Oh great, not you again. What are you talking about? I'm sure we've never met. Weren't you the guy that talked my ear off for nine hours about a rectal tumor? Oh, that must have been my cousin. We're twins. I guess that gets confusing since you both drive these giant tick things. No more or less confusing than you might think it might look like it looks. From your perspective, anyway. Point taken. Can you take us to Port Town Citiesville? Of course. Welcome to Port Town Citiesville, where the wine flows like a river, and the beer also flows like a river. What about the ladies? They don't flow at all unless you drop a few coins on them. It's just that kind of place. Well, I guess we should find a pirate and get with the convincing them to help us. I'm sure it won't take much. There's one right over there. Go dazzle him with your impressive array of people skills. Hello, sir. My name is Reynaldo, and I'm an assassin from Balmora. Get to the point and make it quick. Grrr. I need some help taking down the Ninja's Guild. Ha! That's a good one. But I'm afraid I can't help you even if I wanted to. The Ninjas and Pirates have finally reached an accord and are no longer skirmishing. Reached an accord? You mean you're not sworn enemies anymore? Yar, we're still sworn enemies, but it's not that simple, lad. Let me spin you a little yarn here. It might clear things up. All right, but I don't know how a yarn is going to help me. Shut up and listen. I'll need to begin from the beginning. Arr. 